Hey guys, welcome back to another Swiss Soldier 1 video. And today we are back in x -Plane, in x -Plane 10 Mobile. And why aren't you using the x -Plane 11 desktop version, you might ask? Well, there's a simple reason for that. Well, I'm, I'm not home, so I don't have my gaming PC with me. So uh, I'm kind of forced to use my phone or my laptop to record videos. Now, um, as you can see right here, we have spawned into an A320, which also is for a reason. Now, today... Why don't we have sound, by the way? That's weird. Today, we're going to talk about slats and flaps and what they are and their differences. Now, uh, most of my viewers are not that newbie, so they might already know what flaps are all about. Let's just start this video with deploying the flaps slash slats. Let's just go full flaps, 35 degrees. As you can see right here, there we go. We can see the animation. This is quite a poorly textured aircraft. Disgusting! But we can still tell what is going on here as the animations are quite accurate. As you can see right here, we have just deployed our flaps but if we look in front of the aircraft we can see that something else has come down which obviously most of you guys should have already noticed before on an aircraft now obviously since the slats came out when the flaps came out that's a weird sentence for some reason. You can definitely tell that it's kind of part of the whole flaps system. And what flaps basically do is it uh, does magic and it, <laughs> it allows the plane to maintain a stable flight in lower speeds. That's kind of all what flaps do. And they also add some drag, which can be nice. And that's basically all the slats do. They basically, they basically give even more effect to the flaps, as you can see right here. Now, as you might know, some aircraft have slats, some don't. For example, I spotted a Dassault Falcon today, and that one had slats. But I spotted some other aircraft that didn't have slats, for example. Obviously, this A320 has slats, and the 737 has slats. You know, Boeing has actually faced issues before because their slats were quite bad, especially on the Max models. They had some issues. Talking about issues, let's actually kill our slats. In the failures menu that we have in the mobile version of this flight simulator, we can select the slats to fail, and so that they just don't come down, I guess. Let's just see what difference that makes. Let's just try to take off. Normally, an A320 is able to safely operate at this airport. Let's go flaps 15 degrees and uh, see what happens, right? And yeah, about my spotting day, you should follow me on Instagram. Thank you. And as you can see right here, the slats are straight as a candle. Let's see if we actually have any effect and we are rolling off the runway. That's not good. Yeah, I've really forgotten how to fly a plane with your phone, but yeah. Okay. Uh, normally, we should already be able to rotate and we have just rotate. It was actually not bad, was it? Uh, can we go home now or, or what is the plan? I mean, that worked, right? Oh, this was not too interesting. Let's remove the flaps too. I mean, <laughs> what do we have to lose? Now, if we remove the whole flaps, actually, then we might actually have some effect, obviously. Okay, that was not supposed to happen, I guess. Now, another test that I would like to do is actually kind of a stall test. You know, obviously, you stall at a lower speed when you have flaps deployed slash slats. So let's try stalling out this plane with and without slats. Right now, we have slats working. Let's put the flaps to 35 degrees slash slats. Now, our flaps are fully deployed. Let's go ahead and, uh, you know, stall out this aircraft and see what happens. Let's check if the slats are also out. They are out. That's great. 100 knots. 100 knots is pretty low, actually. Maybe thanks to the slats. Yeah, the Airbus stall prevention system tried to save us here, but no. All right, let's try the same thing without slats. Right full power and let's just casually take off all right we have taken off successfully flaps are almost fully deployed that is good let's just go ahead and uh, stall out this plane again as always let's see how long it takes until this plane stalls out okay it was actually 20 knots earlier not too bad and my recording stopped yeah we kind of died there again but we could actually we could actually see a major difference. Very good. But I'm quite sure that not every plane requires slats. But yeah, guys, thank you for watching today's shorter video. Uh, I'm kind of busy right now. And I'll see you tomorrow. As always, good night.